Hey guys and welcome back to the Tech Gaming Lane channel. In this episode of Car Mechanic Simulator today, Series 3, Episode 14 I believe, we'll be fixing a 1968, um, 1968, um, Tempest Magnum I believe today. I think it's a 1968, I don't, I don't know the exact date. But I do know it is the Tempest Mag Magnum today we got a fix. So, I think it's in 1968 though. I'm not sure. And today, I think what we're gonna what we're gonna fix on it is the um, gearbox. This gearbox issues on it we gotta fix. And things the gearbox issues. I'm gonna take the yeah. It's in 1968. Things the gearbox issues aren't going to take very long to sort out. I thought we'd do the um, um, body issues as well. Things the gearbox issue isn't not going to take very long to sort out. So um, that, let's start rambling and um, let's get to it, shall we, guys? And we, uh, before I start talking, um. If you do like this, uh, if you do like this video or any other video you see on my channel, give it a like, a subscribe, a comment, and don't forget to share. It'd be greatly appreciated, guys. Thank you. So we'll take it to the um, lift. We'll take it to the lift A, and see what we can do. And as always, guys, before I like to always start with a clean slate by going to the um, shopping list and clearing the shopping list. So, and by now, I should have by now gone to the inventory and cleared all my inventory. But I didn't, so we'll do that now. Because I would have done it all by now, cleared all the inventory, but I didn't. So we will sell all everything. Call the money back. So everything's all, everything's all hunky dory now. Everything's cleared. Everything's so. Let's get started and see what we have to buy and what we can fix and all that jazz. So as I was saying, this is a nice, looks a nice looking car. Hoping we can fix all the body panels and that, but what we're going to start off with first is the um, gearbox issues. We're going to start off with first, then the body panels. I'm hoping we don't have to buy any body panels, we can just fix them. But it's how it's how, the pain is going to, if the, if, as I said before, if it's less than 10% or 10%. Dead on the dark, we won't be able to fix any of them. But um, I'm hoping we will. So, um, but as I said before, what we're going to start with is um, the gearbox issue first. So, and this is how you fix the gearbox. Not in real I don't think it is in real life, but um, we can give it a whirl. I think it might be slightly similar in real life, but um, not exactly. In real life, it might be slightly similar though. And I will make another short on this anyway, just um, to so you know, yeah, yeah, to do a gear, gearbox, um, fixing the gearbox. I will do another short on it. So, um, I did do a short on it a while back, so. I will do another short on it to um, refresh you guys. The shorts are helping a lot on my channel as well. So, um, I know the shorts that I do aren't very interesting, but, um, and oh, uh, yeah, before we start, guys, before we get rid of the gearbox, press the ex um, X button to add it to your shopping list if anybody has got. Anybody that's got the game, press the X button on your keyboard to add it to your shopping list, or you can um, press the space bar on your keyboard when you're in your inventory, and it's in your in the inventory, and you selected it in your inventory, 
Press the space bar on your keyboard to so put it on your shopping list instead. But I like doing it this way. It's a lot easier than going into your inventory and um, doing it. So, uh, I think these are going to be less than 10%, so I don't think these are going to be able to be fixed. So, put them on my shopping list. I don't think they're going to be able to be fixed. I know the um, housing isn't going to be able to be fixed. And I don't think this is either, though. If it's 10% or, yeah, that's 10%. If it's 10%, you're not able to fix it. But if it's higher than 10%, you might have a chance to fix it. So what we'll do now is go to um, the tablet. Or if you haven't got the tablet, you go over to the, um, I'll just show you now. If you haven't got the tablet, you go over to the computer here, over here. If you haven't got the tablet, but well, most of you by now would have had got the tablet. But as I said, if you haven't got it, unlock it if you can by doing upgrades on your on your um. It's greatly helpful if you've got the tablet. But if you haven't, that's how you um. It's the way you wanna. It's the way you want to get, get to the um, shop. But if you haven't, you go well, go to the computer there. You haven't got your tablet. So anyway, anyway, go to the tablet or your computer. Um, go to the main shop. And if you've got them in your shopping list, you just um, click on the one you want and click buy. Then click on your shopping list again, click on the one you want, click buy. Simple as. Simple as that, really. So, all those are bought. So now, it's just the reverse of what I've just done, really, is... I'm sure I just bought that, but obviously I didn't. So again, when you make small mistakes like I've just done. What is it that I need? Is that a clutch? Yeah. When you make small mistakes like I've just done. Yeah, we want a clutch. I'll put a clutch pressure plate. We didn't want a clutch pressure plate, I don't think. We've got one anyway. We just want a clutch. So when you haven't got it on your shot, when you have... When you haven't got this is the perfect opportunity. So when you haven't got any shopping list, you just put in the word you want at the top of the list there, or you can search for it manually. And provided you don't have the quotes or work if you're provided you don't have the quotes. And you just um search for it manually or you can put in the word at the top there that you want. And comes up here, comes up with a load of them, or maybe only one of them if there's only one in the shop. And um, that is it. Basically, you just buy it and go. So, um, we'll just um, it's the reverse of what you've just done. It needs to just. When you took it apart, the reverse is to put it back together, in it. So, yeah, that was 10%, so I weren't able to fix that. I weren't able to fix the bearing either. And I don't think you can fix bearings. You release bearing anyway. I don't think you can fix them. I'll have a go, but I'm pretty sure you can't fix them. And I'm pretty sure you can't fix the... um. Some of them you can, and some of them you can't. I'm pretty sure you might be able to fix these out of them, out of casings, but uh, I've tried before, and they're, they're only about. I've tried before, and they're only about a certain lot, like, um, higher than ten percent, and I ain't been able to be in, been able to fix them. So I'm not sure on that. I know I've done it before, though. I'm sure I have. 
But um, anyway, that's the gear buckle I thought you know. So hopefully, that's all that's all you know. It was a yes. But as I said, what we what we don't want to forget is guys is um the um rise shaft because I'm always forgetting that at some point. That and the um starter mode I'm always forgetting, but today I have I have remembered the starter mode, so that's a bonus for me because I'm always forgetting things like that. So anyway, that's done. All the all underneath is done now. I could finish here. I could finish here and say adios to the car. But I want to see whether I can fix the panels. So um, we're not going just yet. So I've got a lot of money to play with. So you're going to need to buy some windows. Because the windows are bad. So we can't fix the windows. So we're going to need to buy some light, win light and the windows things for this car and I don't think the back comes off the bumper does which I think we can fix the bumper and the license plate do it does so I think we can do improve the license plate license plate a bit more the lights I'm going to leave it's the body work I'm gonna I'm gonna do so, I know if you're doing this, you should do the whole duty match, but I'm just going to do the body work. I'm not going to do the lights. I'm just going to do the body work. And that, that is going to be able to be fixed. So... I'm just putting it on the shopping list just in case it's not going to be able to be fixed. But most of this, I think, is going to be, be able to be fixed. So... And uh, from window screen, we're going to get... So, but I'll start with taking this, these pieces off. That's got to go. That's got to go. And the door's got to go. Fenders are gonna go. That's gonna go. And we can't do anything with the doors. Well, well the back there ain't got really any doors at the back of though really. That's gotta go as well. And that'll go as well. And the front bumper as well is gonna go. I'm pretty sure we'll be able to fix all of these. So, um, I know it look. Uh, I know that's going to take me uh, the lights out and everything, but I can fit them back in there and we want the window screen as well. So, before, before we do, though, what I'll do. I've took everything up now, so what we'll do is take a photo of it when it's in this bad shape and take a photo of it afterwards. So, snap a shot of it now. And then we'll just take the right side of the door, the right side of the door off, I believe. Just take that off, and off, and the window screen from here and at the side, if I can get to it. I think I've done the back, and the rear window screen we want as well. So let's see what we can fix and what we can't, shall we, guys? Welcome back to the car, and now we'll um, assemble the car back to its former glory. Okay, 
and his phone glove is blue. So what we'll do is paint it all blue if we can. I'm sure we got enough money to deal with that with, so I'll do the windows afterwards because we've got to buy the windows because we can't fix them. So And I'm sure I did we do the bumpers as well. I'm pretty sure we did those. I know the lights look amazing, but I'm just going to leave the lights. I know I'm, I'm doing a half a half a job here, but um, but do the lights and everything's going to be a bit long. Uh, I'm gonna be, I don't want it to be too long, so what we could do though is to get most, rid of most of the rust is, I forgot what we could do is, um, do, um, welding, which is, if people don't, if you guys don't know what the welding, welding thing does here is, cost your money, 1,000, depends on, Depends on how much, but it costs you money. What the welding thing does is clears up all the welding, uh, all the rust on the outside. Not on the wheels or anything like that, but it clears up all the bits you can see on the outside that you saw before. It clears all that up. So. so I believe now what we've got to do is just the windows now. So. I've just got to purchase the windows, so hang on a second, guys, while I purchase the windows, and... I didn't buy that one, did I? My office could buy mine, you know what I mean? Um, why did I put a door on it when I fixed the doors? Hang on a second, guys. Go back into it. I did put a bump on it because we needed that, but we didn't need it because we did. I'll tell you what the best practice is to do, guys. Is when you've actually finished it, I'll show you when I've actually finished it. That is the best practice is to do, guys, when you've actually finished the car. Is to clear all your inventory. Is the best practice. Because otherwise... That is the best practice to do, that is. Before you leave, clear all your inventory. So you're all set for next time, if you know what I'm saying. And that's what I will do when we before we leave, is I'll clear all my inventory out. So we're, not, we're all set for next time. I know I should, I should do that whole shooting match here, guys, but, um, basically, I really can't be bothered to do any of all that. No, I really should, but, uh, I think that's it, guys, I think, apart from taking it to the, sh taking it to the, um, paint shop, I think. 
Take it to the paint shop and sort it out in the paint shop and clean it up. And where's the paint shop at? Paint shop? Take it to the paint shop because we've got a load of money anyway. And the colour we actually want, what colour should we go for? Should we go for that colour or the blue colour or the actual blue colour here? I think we'll go for the blue colour. Um, so we need to go to that. I'll paint the whole thing. We'll paint it that colour, I think. Yeah. And we'll go with a metallic. And we we'll go. Yep. I know the fact factory colour was that dark blue, but we'll go for this blue instead. And yeah, guys, so if you're in the paint booth and you want to paint, and you just click the button paint. Just click it. No, what you're gonna do is hold, hold the left click, hold the left click button down, and it'll, uh, and it'll do it. Or press the enter button, and it'll do it. So this is um. This is the car now. And I know I haven't done the lights, guys, or the interior, or any of that. What we could do is in clean up the interior as well. Couldn't be so What we're going to do first, though, is take a photo of it with this new paint colour. This is what we're going to do first, guys. And do a bit of fun now, man. Nice looking car there. So. And what we can do now is take it to the cleaning booth, cleaning, cause cleaning place, because we're in the um, we want the we want the car wash, and we'll just wash the car, even though we just painted it, we'll wash it. And we'll do the inside as well. So, it looks hell of a lot better, guys. Kind of me. Apart from the lights, I didn't bother doing the lights because the lights are working. There's no point changing them if the way. If they're working. Um, so what we'll do again, guys, is I'll just press. I'll just press it. I'll just take a photo of it. Without going to the camera now. And. And that should be it now for now, guys. Is I'll just. Um, get rid of it from here. And that would be, we got a decent amount when we've done some extra jobs there. So we got a decent amount of money for that, for, for doing all that. So that's 4,547 credits. We got a decent amount of, we got a decent amount of money for that. And we did forget the license plates. So it might help if I remember them, might it? So what we'll do is take it back to the garage in that case. And we will buy brand new license plates. Yeah, we'll buy the brand new license plates because it's going to look better with brand new license plates in it. So. Plates. And I'm pretty sure I put these on the list. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure I did. And by the look of things, no, I didn't put it on the list. Oh, yes, I did. I want two of them, you know, I think, yeah. So, pay. So, we should... We put the number plates back on and we should be ready to go then there. And guys.
So that's brand new number plates. Haven't done the lights, done everything else. Nice colour though, it's got to be a very, very nice colour. A nice colour blue. So now we can send it off. So we got that amount of room for it, guys. So we can say, we can say bye bye to that Tempest um, Mag Magnum. So, and guys, we have got a lot of money. So for the next episode, I think I will pick a um, car from a, um, a salvage place and see what we can do with a car for the salvage place. So. I'm not going to do it, pick it now. I'm going to do it off camera. So, be a surprise for you guys the next episode. But I don't know when the next episode will be because I've got a lot of things. I've got a lot of games to get. I've got a lot of games to do. So, I don't know when the next episode will be, whether it'll be next week or the week after. So, um, but, um, as always, guys, if you did like this episode, Give it a like, a subscribe, a comment, and don't forget to share and all that jazz. This has been Tech Gaming Lane. Bye for now, guys. Bye for now.